Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Kiru Timona. Hakiti Tinye. Kibata Je. Sopela. Whatever give us a ruta, who do I live my emo? Otonete has Satan and Rata who are Matla who Titina. Omojas only Kitu Timona. Hey, I get it in ye. Jesus Christ. Do you love Jesus? Do you love Jesus Christ? It's a beautiful day for us, especially at Divine. Especially at Divine is a very beautiful day for us today. Because when my father goes spiritual birthday, I go my own birthday. When he goes spiritual, I go physical. When he goes spiritual, I manifest. <laughs> Hallelujah. So I'm a true son indeed. Because when he goes spiritual, he manifests and I come forth. Hallelujah. So as we celebrate, celebrate my father's spiritual birthday, I celebrate my birthday. So we are very blessed, especially the divine. I'm not 
I still have to negotiate. I still have to negotiate. Actually, I should call myself the firstborn. Yeah. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We, we don't have much time. But there is something that I would like you to share about the father. A father, it's like a, a corn. A father is like a seed. Because the seed for it to produce, it needs to die. You need to bury it and then it's going to produce more. And it is upon us or it's upon you or I how you treat the father. A father can become a blessing to you. A father can become a curse to you. Depending on how you treat the father. Because the father has got a, some sort of a special authority in him that you cannot take. So you need to be very much careful of, on how you treat the father. Hallelujah. Do you love Jesus Christ? Do you love Jesus? A father, it depends on how you treat. I would say the father is like money. The father is like money. People used to say money, it is bad. Some, they say money, it is good. Hallelujah. Now, it depends on how you use the money. If you use the money for the evil, you will reap the evil. But if you use the money for the good, you will reap good. So, if, if you want the father to become a curse, it is up to you the father will become a case. If you want the father to become a blessing, a father becomes a blessing to you. So I just want to advise my brothers and sisters that we need, because all of us, I believe we need a blessing. We need to learn on how we treat the father. You need to treat the father in a such a way that he has no option but to speak blessings upon your life at every time. When, when, when your image appears in his spirit, he just speaks blessing. You, you need to provoke his spirit that wherever he is, he only speaks blessing upon your life. <laughs> Hallelujah. Do you love Jesus Christ? Do you love Jesus? So, I want to honor my father, our father, by saying, uh, Papa, we honor you in this beautiful day. And we say, thank you, Papa, that you have realized that you are a father and you became a father. You compromised your life that you can become a father. It's not everyone who can be a father. It takes a father to be a father. It takes a father to be a father. Not just someone or a man to be a father. So we thank you, Papa, that you have compromised your life that you can give birth to us. <laughs> Some, they are running in the streets not because they like it, it's because they, they don't have a father. We rejoice, we are inside the house, we are in a warm place, we have a food. It is because we have a father, which is you, Papa. So we are blessed in this house to have you. We pray that the Lord may keep you more and more years and continue to release mysteries to you. That us as well, we become fathers like you are. A father manifests in a son, and a son needs to be found in a father.
That's the reason why Jesus said that if you have seen me, you have seen the Father. Me and the Father are one. Hallelujah. So if we're going to walk out there and still our Father is not seen in us, there is still something that is lacking. You need, when you walk out there, you need your Father to be seen in you. <laughs> Hallelujah. We thank you, Papa, for your life. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's clap our hands for Jesus Christ. Such beauty, we appreciate that. We can do better than that. Let's clap hands for Jesus. Indeed, when you see the Son, you see the Father, and when you see the Father, you see the Son. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Come on, give him a hand of applause. Come on, give me a hand of applause. Shout Jesus. Shout Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. So we are moving on to our next item. Um, uh, our next item is Mercy Seat Ministries. Uh, Mercy Seat Ministries, as they come forward, let's give them a hand of applause. May the Lord bless them which is being uh, led by Pastor Tepo Mukot. Let's clap hands for them as they come to the front. Let's continue clapping, clapping, clapping as they come forth. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Oh, Jesus, it is nice to be in the presence of the Lord. Hallelujah. First and foremost, I'd like to, I'd like to take this time and honor our Father. And um, I'd like to honor the anointing upon the Father of the house. Really, man of God, the anointing. Your anointing is too much, and we thank you for giving birth to our mother, our spiritual mother. We can see that the anointing is really genuine anointing. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Can we all stand in the presence of the Lord as we're going to continue praising God? I need you to dance like never before. I need you to sing like never before. I need you to praise him like never before.
Now, the song that you are about to sing now, I need you to jump off your seats. See, Olele, Mshugumis, Mshugumis, Olele, because we're going to dance. The song that we're going to sing it says, Fire, Fire. And I'm going to say, Where can you feel it? You're going to say, it All over me. Hallelujah! Hallelujah!
Listen, I'm gonna come to each and every one of you. When I pick you, you dance. It's a dance challenge. Are you ready? Are you ready? Fire, fire! Fire! Fire, fire! 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 Fire!
voices. One more time. One more time. Amen. Okay. Amen, Bazalwan. Amen, Papa, on behalf of our spiritual mother and the ministry, we have something for you on behalf of the ministry. Come on, give him a hand of applause. Lord Jesus. Come on, let's celebrate. Let's celebrate them. Let's celebrate. Let's celebrate our Father. Let's celebrate our Father. As they honor, we honor. As they honor, we honor. Come on, give them a round of applause. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. That was a nice one, eh? Hallelujah. So, come on, give them a hand of applause. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Are you still happy in the house of the Father? Are you still celebrating your father? Come on, shout. Let me hear that you're celebrating. Yes! Yes! Thank you, Lord Jesus. So we're going right ahead, you know, uh, without a waste of time. Um, 
we're running after time. Uh, Grace Living Hope Ministries, uh, you, are, you are called to come forward. Let's give them a round of applause as they're coming forward. We are the peculiar generation. We have been ordained as a peculiar generation by the Spirit. Born of the Spirit, we are the Spirit. A Spirit without measure. We are the visible representatives of the invisible God. The true reflection of Christ himself. We are the manifestation of God's glory. We are the peculiar generation. We are without the black box. I greet you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, standing before thee with different names, but unitedly so as sons of glory. We would like to honor the anointing upon the house. Rabonic thunderstorm. Arise and shine, for the light has come. Like an eagle, the storm rider has, has I killed. Arise and shine, for the light has come. Like an eagle, the storm rider has landed. Nation far and wide had heard of it, but in amusement call it witchcraft. I lift up my eyes to the mountain. Behold, he came riding on the storms. He moves in mysterious waves and, and set his footsteps upon the seas. He is prophesy Daniel, the storm rider. He proclaimed the gospel far and wide. Even if they shoot him with words, he rises like a sufferness into ashes. Amongst presidents and leaders, he is our shepherd, the Daniel of our times. He is the mystery. A wise rebuker who has an obedient ear, out of his words come shedding raindrop of love, peace, and patience. A real soldier, marching, marching, looking at one direction, climbing high in the mountain to receive salutation from the hills. Trees of the fields lap in their hands. Storm Rider, you are the true reflection of Christ himself. He is a celebrity, populating the kingdom of heaven. Oh, how famous he is. They call him the grass pastor, but he is our shepherd who quenched our thirst with petrol. Mmm, how I like it when he says, my sheep come. Who can interfere with the interference of the storm rider? No one can interfere with the interference of the storm rider because where he interferes, God intervenes. He commands fire to be cold. He makes people's hair to be heavy. Iwele, what manner of a man is he? He did not come for peace, but he is a rock of offense, causing the falling and rising of many. When we are lost in the darkness, he did not fold his arms, but he folded his shirt and reached out to us. He did not find us to make us slaves, but he ordained us as sons. Oh, how humble he is. He did not bring teachings about Jesus, but he brought forth unto us Christ as the Messiah. He has come to leave those who had fallen and offend those who thought they knew Christ. The sun darkened. The moon gives no light. The stars fall from the sky. The powers in heaven shake. The wind blowing fearlessly at shook. The rock was split, coming with power and great glory. Suddenly there was a great earthquake to reveal this light driver that comes out of a rubble. Rabbi, my teacher from Unigo. His face shined like lightning. His eyes were like flames of fire, and on his head were many crowns. Out of his word proceed a word like a rushing wave. Fear and terror covered the earth, and this caused many to wonder and say, this must be witchcraft. Behold, the tremendous voice has spoken. Touch not the anointed. Happy birthday, Storm Rider. We love you. 
We thank you for producing God light. The one who teaches us to hold on what we have learned. The one who grants us mysteries. <laughs> Storm Rider, today God has made you a feared man throughout the nation. Today we are able to salute and honor you. We thank you. Let's clap our hands for Jesus Christ.